Is the Thermaltake Tough Fan 12 a blatant ripoff of Noctua's NFA 12 by 25, or is it a worthy competitor? Well, we're gonna compare the two and find out. Rich, are you ready? I am, let's do this. All right, Rich, I have Thermaltake's Tough Fan 12 sitting here, and I also have a Noctua NFA 12 by 25. So, we're gonna do this in one video. Why? Why would we put this fan against this fan? Because this is a lot older than this guy. Mm -hmm. Well, the honest reason is because the Tough Fan 12 looks like a clone of the NFA 12x25, as if Thermaltake snuck into Noctua's headquarters, stole the secret formula, and started mass producing them. So, we wanted to take this time in this video to compare these two fans and see if Thermaltake can actually create a competitor that is cheaper and better than the Noctua NFA 12x25. Ready to do this? Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's talk about this fan. Released in early August 2020, the Thermaltake Tough Fan 12 has a 9-blade design, uses a hydraulic bearing, has a fan speed of 500 to 2000 RPM, has a 4-pin PWM power connector, and includes an LNC or low-noise cable to reduce the fan speed further. Weighs in at 189 grams, has a 2-year warranty, and we bought this fan for $20 on Amazon. Now let's talk about the Noctua NFA 12 by 25 we reviewed this fan a long time ago and it's been on the market for quite some time now. Here are the specs. The NFA 12 by 25 has a 9 blade design. Uses Noctua's specially designed SSO2 or self stabilizing oil pressure bearing. Has a fan speed of 450 to 2000 RPM. Has a 4 pin PWM power connector and also includes an LNA or low noise adapter to reduce maximum RPMs further. Weighs in at 198 grams. Has a 6 year warranty and is available on Amazon for around $30 USD. At a glance, these fans look to be very similar, ignoring the colors. Looking closer at the blades, you see very similar patterns in the material itself as if the blades are made out of similar material. However, there are some clear differences, like the flow acceleration channels on the tops of the blades of the NFA 12x25, which are missing from the smooth blades of the Tough Fan 12. At a high level, both fans look to be functionally identical on paper with nearly the same speeds and features, with the exception of the Tough Fan's price being cheaper. All that really matters though is how well these fans perform and which one is the better of the two. To test this, we'll be using our standard fan testing protocol. First, we'll mount each fan into a specially designed 3D printed duct to duct air directly onto an anemometer to test airspeed. Next, we're going to test the same fans attached to a radiator and duct it through another 3D printed housing. We'll run these tests at both full and half speed to give you an idea of how they compare. Then we'll take both fans and run them at full and half fan speed and measure how much noise they make, normalize the room ambient levels. This will give us a good idea of how noisy these fans can be. Now, on to those results. The results speak an interesting story. Across the board, the Thermaltake Tough Fan 12 fell short behind the Noctua NFA 12x25 in all areas except for noise. In the full speed direct airflow test, the Tough Fan 12 came in at 4.2 meters a second to Noctua's 4.4 meters a second. In the half-speed direct airflow, both fans were close with a tough fan coming in at 2.5 meters a second to Noctua's 2.6 meters a second. In the airflow radiator test, once again the tough fan fell behind Noctua. In the full-speed radiator airflow test, the Thermaltake Tough Fan 12 pushed 3 meters a second through the radiator with Noctua coming in at 3.3 meters a second. In the half-speed radiator airflow test, the tough fan again failed to top the NFA 12x25 at 1.7 meters a second to Noctua's 2 meters a second. It's clear that the NFA 12x25 performs better in static pressure tests. Now onto fan noise. Interestingly, the tough fan outperformed the Noctua NFA 12x25 in both full speed and half speed fan noise tests, though by slim margins. With both fans running at the same RPM speed, the best we can tell here is that it's possible the NFA 12x25 produces slightly more turbulent air as part of their intended design, making them slightly noisier. That being said, in both cases, both fans' noise output was well within acceptable ranges and would not add a significant amount of noise to your PC. So is this a Noctua killer? Definitely not. However, it's around $10 cheaper than Noctua, has plenty of length for your connections inside your PC, and it's black, which might be the biggest selling point. That being said, it's well known that Noctua is planning to release the NFA 12x25 in black as part of their Chromax line sometime in the very near future, if not already by the time you've seen this video. Another point to make is that the Thermaltake Tough Fan 12 comes with only a two-year warranty to Noctua's six-year warranty. Ridiculous. Noctua also has rubber anti-vibration mounts, an anti-vibration gasket for making a better seal against your radiators, and more as part of the standard package. Overall, for the extra 10 bucks, you're getting a better deal. So while the Tough Fan is cheaper in price, it feels like a cheaper knockoff of the NFA 12x25. 
It also feels like Thermal Take is trying to capitalize on an audience out there who want black fans that have Noctua-like performance and are unwilling to wait for the Chrome X NF H12 by 25 to drop. One last thing to note, while these fans don't beat Noctua in performance, they are pretty close. And because of that lower price point, it might force Noctua to lower the prices of their fans. Both these fans are considered premium fans, and in the past, the NF A12x25 fans went for as much as $45 on Amazon. Depending on how successful the Tough Fan Series ends up being over time, might have an impact on that, and it never hurts to have more competition in the market. And that, ladies and gentlemen, will do it for our video today. John and I genuinely hope you enjoyed watching as much as we enjoyed making it, and we'd love to know what you think about the video, the Thermal Take Tough Fan 12, the Noctua NF A12x25. Please get down in those comments and let us know. If this is the first time you've seen us, please consider subscribing because it really helps us out and keeps us making these videos. We've got a website right here. We put all the results from all of our testing, including the testing from this video. If you're an Instagram or Twitter follower, you can follow us here at Two Guys Tech. Thank you for watching, and we will see you again soon.